Thanks for stopping in to eMusic Live Piano. Today we're going to talk about making and understanding major chords. We're going to learn every major chord in every key or we're going to understand how to form any major chord starting with C major. Now our first chord will be the C major chord. We like to start with C because C is the only natural key. That means that the natural notes make up its scale or the C major scale. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then back to C for resolve. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven notes. And that is the key of C major. Now our major chords come from the first, third, and fifth note of every major scale. Okay? So C is the first note, D is the second note, E is third, F is fourth, G is fifth, A is sixth, B is seven, and back to C. And that's how we play our major scale. One, two, three, thumb. One, two, three, four. Once again, one, two, three, thumb, G, A, B, and then C. That's our major scale. So we're only going to use the first five notes in the major scale melody to make our major chords. And we're going to do that with every one of them. We're going to start with C. C, E, G. And that's the one, three, and five note of the C major scale. Now, let's move to F, which is also a natural triad. A triad is a three note chord. F, A, C. Notice we're using the same finger. Our fingers are numbered one, two, three, four, five, just like we have them sitting out on the keys. F, G, a, B, and C. We're going to take F, A, and C for our F major chord. All right, that was C major. Notice we can keep our hand in the same formation. F major. We're going to do the same thing with G. G, B, and D. That's our G major chord. So now we have three major chords from the key of C major. C, F, and G. F, and C. You might hear a song in there. might have a little fun with that. Now there are those are three that's three of the chords. There are seven chords in our natural in our natural notes that we're going to use. So we're going to use C and we're going to move to D. Now D requires that we add a sharp note. So we're going to go D, same fingering, F sharp, A. That's our D chord. D major. Now we'll move to E major, which is E, G sharp, and B. That's E major. Next, we'll move to A major, which is A, C sharp, and E. A major. So those were D, E, and A. So let's start from the beginning with C, which is C, E, G, D, D, F sharp, A, E, E, G sharp, B, F, F, A, C, G, G, B, D, and A. 
A, C sharp, E. Now the last chord in the sequence is going to be the chord B major, which requires that we use two sharp notes. B, D sharp, F sharp. Notice we use the same fingers every time. Okay, so it's C, D, E, F, G, A, B, and then back to C. And that is the C major chord, D major chord, E, F, G, A, B, and C covered there. Okay, next we'll get into the chords that are formed by using the sharps and flats.